What's good everybody? Mr. J here. Thanks for tuning in. Welcome back. And as you can see, I have two very special guests today. These are my daughters. This is Kelsey. And this is Brooklyn. All right. And girls, what are we going to be doing today? We are going to be doing a Bob Ross painting. That's right. We're going to be doing what we call a Bob Ross challenge. Now, what's going to be challenging about it, Brooklyn? Me and Kelsey get to paint and my dad only has who use nothing but a tablet. That's right. They're going to use they're going to follow the Bob Ross painting tutorial using all the traditional mediums, but the catch is I have to use nothing but my iPad and Apple Pencil. We'll see how this is going to go. Kelsey, who do you think is going to win this challenge? Um I I don't really know. I think all of our paintings might are all going to be good. And what the heck are you doing right now? Hmm? What the heck are you doing? Why are you painting white on white? Bob Ross likes to cover his um, canvas with white, so that's what I'm doing. All right, and contestant number two over here in the four foot corner. Are, are you even four foot yet? I don't know. <laughs> And are you going to win this challenge? I don't know. There might be a chance of Kelsey winning because I'm not really good at drawing. But I might win too. So I maybe think me, I might win. Okay. And you're painting a white canvas white too. Because um, Bob Ross does it. And we want to make sure our painting is good, and that's why we're doing it. So that the colors can blend together, right? Mm-hmm.
The ones that I like the most are the house and those trees. The ones that I really need to work on are that tree and that tree. If you're my friend and I told you to watch this video, make sure to go into the comments and vote for me because I really want to win. And make sure to give the big thumbs up and subscribe now. Bye. All right, and for mine, like I did think, um, you know, I, I did struggle a little bit trying to find the appropriate strokes to manipulate some of the moves that he was doing. Um, so, I mean, it is what it is, but, you know, happy with the end result. The trees, I did not think I was going to be able to pull the trees off as well uh, without there being any kind of fan brush, but uh, I did find a stroke in there that worked fairly well. All right, well, down below, don't forget to comment. Don't forget to let them know they did a great job and comment which one you think should win this challenge. Doing something a little special going on forward. They're going to be launching their own YouTube channel. We're going to be doing challenges and drawing tutorials for children similar to this. So they're really excited for it. Stay tuned. All right, everybody. This is Mr. J. Thanks for tuning in. Have a good weekend.